Hey everybody, welcome back to Fails of the Week, where we look at the funniest social media fails of the week. And like, if you haven't subscribed, could you just like do that already? Like, damn, what's a girl gotta do? It's upsetting, I'm upset, you're upsetting me. You have the most beautiful eyes. Thanks, so what's up cutie? Talking to this really cool dude. Really, would I know him? Cry, <laughs> cry laugh emoji. Yeah, I'm going on a date with him tomorrow night after I get off work. No, you don't know him. Gotcha. I'll leave them. He literally asked himself questions on his Instagram and didn't realize we can see it. <laughs> when will you me? When you fly all the way from Australia to my city. When are you dropping at Bury Your Heart? I can't freaking wait. In about a week or two, stay tuned. Yeah, no, he, like you can fully see that it's like his profile picture that that's, oh, that's, that's sad, that's so sad. I mean, theoretically, it would be a good idea for like promo, if you could find a way, like you could have like some fake accounts or something like that, but don't use your own account. That's just silly. You're silly, silly S goose. <laughs> Please use tongues to pick pastries, thanks. <laughs> oh really? Is it, but you said it's like it's literally what the sign says. I'm sorry, officer. I just I was confused. Pardon me. While I squeak. The most private thing I'm willing to admit. I'm a sex addict. Are you? Don't know. Uh... Like, are you saying like, what do you mean by that? Like you're you're like an addict where people go and have sex. Oh, sex addict. Right, I get it now. Mm. I, I, I didn't know because you spelled it wrong. That has to be photo chopped. You know what? I actually don't know if it is because I think I've actually been on this exact cruise that looks like a princess cruise and um, it stops really, really, really close to Venice and then you take these little boat dinghies down to St. Mark's Square and I, I actually don't think it is. And it's not photo chopped either. Just... Why do I spit so much? <laughs> I'm salivating. I'm salivating because I like you. Bro, it's just the gazebo effect. It doesn't actually work. That's a bummer. It didn't work for you. I believe the term you're looking for is placebo. No, gazebo. The gazebo effect. Oh, you've you've never heard of it? Oh, it's 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 quite profound. I lost my apple tight. Did you? You lost it? I'm trying to picture what it would taste like to eat a cookie burger. You know, like two cookies on the outside of some cheese and some beef. Cause I'm like a sweet and savory kind of person. I'm wondering if it would be good. I think it might be tasty. If anyone tries this, let me know. Yummy. My two favorite things, cookies and cheeseburgers. I learned the calzones were pronouns. Calzones and not cow zones. Wait, what? Are you dumb? I never saw how it was spelled, so I assumed it was cow zone. <laughs> you have entered the cow zone. Do you, bunny? Huge bing bag couch free. <laughs> Let's move on. <laughs> My girl fell asleep with her mask on at the beach. <laughs> that's funny. She looks really upset. Oh, that's a bad one too, girl. Ugh. You're gonna be stuck with that for a while. Ooh. Warning! Did your mom ever educate you? Shoplifters will be prostituted! Will they? Yeah? Look at, look at how happy she is to be stealing. <laughs> look at her, she's so stoked. What is that, perfume? And she's like, oh, he's, oh, I'm gonna take this and you're never gonna know. No, you are now the prostituted shoplifter on the wall of shame. Shame, 
Shame. Hope it was worth it. This tree is dropping free grapes. They're kind of crunchy though. <laughs> That's a freaking egg corn, dude. That's an egg corn. You mean it's not just a crunchy grape? What? What? Silly. Silly person. Also, who else is coming this weekend? Just you. I asked you out. Oh yeah, I'm gonna... You know, I'm suddenly very busy. <laughs> I suddenly have a very full schedule. Ooh, so sad, so cringe. I am eating pasta. Ooh, what kind? Give me Carbonara. Carbonara. At this point, guys, it's like, really, really? I don't believe you're that stupid. Like, I just really don't. But then again, I have faith in people. Maybe a little too much faith. Birthday girl, 23 years old. The shadow literally says 29. <gasps> oh, oh, look at that. Oh, that's gotta hurt. Oh, look at she, oh, she added like a, <laughs> that's pretty sneaky though. Like she, sh she should have continued on her little Photoshop rampage and edited out the 29. I don't know how she missed that, honestly. Freaking amateur. <laughs> she looks great though. Not like 29 is like old or anything. You shouldn't be embarrassed of that. It only gets better at 30. I'm just saying. I'm 56 and I'm loving life. My secret? Carbone era. Eat that every day. You'll look like me at 56. <laughs> Would you like to sell your baby? What? What did I just read? Hang on. Hang on a minute. I need to get comfortable for this. Adjust. Would you like to sell your baby? I've recently had a miscarriage and I've been following you on Facebook. She's so beautiful. I've already given her a nickname and bought things for her. You know, I'm... I'm guessing the answer is probably no. I'm very sorry for your loss. Thinking you might be going through some things. Unfortunately, I don't I don't think you're gonna get that baby girl. It's kind of sad. Really sad actually. Hey guys, my parents are out of town party at my house this weekend. LSPD can't come though. And then Lee Summit Police responds. We are actually pretty cool people to hang out with, but we get it. If nothing illegal is going on and no one calls us, we won't come. But based off the number of likes slash comments so far, it doesn't look like anyone else is going either. Oh burn! Oh you just got owned! Mm, the police department! That's gotta hurt. You should just invite them. At least they know what's going on. Knock knock. Who's there. Hatch. Hatch who? Bless you. Lol. This is her boyfriend. How many times do I have to tell you to stop texting her? You're pathetic. <laughs> that was kind of funny though. I kind of like that. Ew! Why do ugly people like me? Ew! I know I'm not like hot, but like I'm adorably cute. So that obviously puts me out of your league. Nice try. Next. Ha 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 ha! I agree with you. All these ugly guys come to me why can't the ugly guys go with the ugly girls and the nice hot talented guys go with the pretty girls i just wish it was simple because you're one of the ugly girls it is that simple oh i see i see that it makes sense now it before i i Guess I just have a very high opinion of myself. Hey, you're my number neighbor, what's up? You just texted my dead husband's phone. I'm so sorry. Well, like, what's going on? You just keep that plugged in? What's going on here, man? You just leave it on in case? How long's it been? Two things I'm afraid of, being at the bar alone in Cougars. Do people ever meet at bars or is that an old wise tale? I don't think it's an old wise tale. I think that it does happen once in a while. Can understand why it's your irrational fear though. Also, you, uh, you, you're doing it wrong. It's wrong. It's all wrong. Selling nudes, $10. You in? Are they of you? Yes, my face will be in them. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> bean, bean. That's got a sting, bro. Are you Katniss from Hunger Games? No. Well, you're causing an uprising in my pants. Wow, you like that? No, not really. Are you lesbian? That's the only possible reason why you couldn't like that. No. Then what's wrong with my <laughs> 
Everything. Everything is wrong. It's all wrong. Scammer made over 500k selling 5G repellent lotion online. I don't really think that's a fail, to be honest. I'm not sure if this belongs in this video, but that's funny. <laughs> Just saw a job ad for a Latin teacher. Ad specified that a successful applicant must be a native speaker of the language. Good luck with that. A native Latin speaker. Pretty sure it's kind of a dead language, TBH. But uh, yeah, we'll see how that works out for you. A guy ordering dessert on a date is a red flag for me. That's a female thing to do for real. It's a red flag for me. For me! If a guy's on a date with a woman, the woman should be the only one asking for appetizers and dessert. Men eat meals. <laughs> like seriously, you can just taste some of whatever I ordered. What the f lady? That's so weird. Your your whole <laughs> tweet is a red flag. <laughs> one student completed the exam, asked him to leave the room. He left his actual room. <laughs> What? It's technically r not wrong. That's what you asked. Technically, you're getting what you asked. Oomph just said Kamala was the first woman vice president. Did Michelle not exist? Michelle was the first lady. That's what I've been saying. Kamala was second. Alright guys, that's it. That's all. That's all, folks. Thanks for coming. Make sure you take your garbage on the way out. Subscribe!